Wise, about these C-41 rumors, it really seems like the situation is pretty bad. Did something happen? To be safe, I got in touch with a few contacts who've explored C-41 to ask them about the rumors of the Hollow becoming active again. Besides the cunning hairs, I tried Bellabog Industries and Victoria Housekeeping. But... So... They don't know either? Even worse, they didn't say anything. They said nothing. So isn't that good? Everything's normal? No, you don't get it. They haven't replied to literally any of my messages. It's like they're missing! When I first told some agents all the rumors and enlisted their help, they promised to keep an eye on C-41 for us. But I haven't heard from anyone since. I have a really bad feeling about this, Wise. If the rumors are true and the Hollow has become active again, could they have gotten trapped while investigating? Fairy, help us investigate. Understood. Searching the Hollow Investigative Association intranet for the keywords Hollow C41, Reactivated, and Golden Week Anomaly. Results. Can we take leave for Golden Week? Reimbursing vacation expenses. Rideshare buddy sought for long distance trip. Filter out all the spam messages first. Filter applied. I will bypass highly sensitive data sources and avoid leaving any traces. The results will be shared with Second Assistant. Wise, if you plan on going into Hollow C41 again, keep an eye out for anyone who's lost. Hopefully I'm just being overly cautious. Now I can pay next month's bill. Today's your lucky day.
Freeze! I can't take these. You keep them. Today's your lucky day. Huh, I picked up Nicole's grid.
Electric charge. Can we start, Wise? Okay, let's get to it. <clears throat> Hello? This is Faithen. Can everyone hear me? Has it started yet? Hello? <sighs> Hello? Can, can, can you hear me? Uh, this is Anton from uh, Bellabog Heavy Industries. The sound and video both clear, but, uh, ah, I'm sorry. <laughs> I just have to warn you that I'm on a construction site right now, and, uh... <laughs> yeah, you might hear something like that. This is Lycom of Victoria Housekeeping speaking. You're coming in quite clearly. I'll keep this brief. We've called everyone together to discuss Hala C-41. We... This is Nicole from the Cunning Hairs. Uh-huh, I can hear you just fine. Uh, Nicole? I think you've got a little lag from your side. Huh? Really? No way. I'm borrowing the Wi-Fi from the office building next door, and they just upgraded their connection. Getting back on track... We've heard rumors from multiple sources saying ether activity in Hollow C-41 is gradually increasing for some unknown reason. If this keeps up, we'll have to consider it an active sub-hollow again. Since you've all experienced getting lost to some degree while exploring C-41, 
We want to get everyone together to share intel and figure out whether or not the rumors are true. Let's start by sharing our recent exploration experiences. Ah, oh, me first! <clears throat> Bellabog Industries is chiefly concerned with researching the military machinery stored in the warehouse and... Uh, and, uh... <sighs> heard was machine noise. The scope of Bellabog Industries' exploration interests partially falls within some warehousing areas, but does not extend too far into C-41. The defensive weapons they've encountered are all normal. Wow, Icon. You've got great hearing. Your praise is misplaced. I couldn't hear over the noise either. I just relied on lip reading. You can read lips? That's even more impressive than good hearing. Uh, hello? Sorry, has the noise stopped? Uh, yeah. Our lupine friend misspoke at the end there. Uh, the defensive weapons we've encountered are not normal. And we're not sure if it's a maintenance issue or due to ether corruption. Forgive me. It seems my lip-reading ability was caught wanting. I have humiliated myself. No, no, it's fine. Just a little slip-up, that's all. The mistake is, however, a keyword of opposite definition. Shut up, Fairy! Allow me to report in second, then. Victoria Housekeeping has explored deeply within C-41, including some of Midsummer Incorporated's warehousing areas. We haven't come across any enemies worth mentioning, though we did see several rookie hollow raiders along the way. Their amateur antics attracted most of the automatic defensive weapons and ethereals who went chasing after them. All right, so we've got some slightly malfunctioning defensive weapons, plus more hollow raiders. Sounds like nothing out of the ordinary, right? We're gonna share experiences? I'll go first. Nicole, you're lagging badly. The other two have already finished. Barry, can you help her out? I've hacked into the network Nicole is borrowing. The password is next-door-can-pay-for-it, all capitals. Oh yeah! Password valid. <laughs> Those cheap suckers next door have never seen the likes of me. Anyway, we Cutting Hairs have explored C-41 the most and the deepest. We've been to pretty much all the storage areas. Other than the Midsummer Defense Systems, we didn't come across any other enemies. So it's mostly those defensive machines. They're prone to corruption, but only devices with anything remotely resembling AI on board have the potential to mutate into an ethereal. Defensive machines are usually low-level, autonomous systems, not AI. In theory, C-41 should be lacking a source to reactivate the ether. So why are there signs of activity rising? Hey, wait! Those midsummer defensive weapons aren't what you think. It's actually a... These interruptions are suspiciously well-timed. Pardon me. If I might be allowed another attempt at lip-reading. This is... Mr. Anton says the Midsummer Defensive Weapons have early AI chips installed, which were their standout feature upon first breaking into the market, and the reason Bellabog wants to study them. Mr. Anton then described a complicated metaphor about drilling, sweat, and... juvenile animals, which is supposed to describe expertise in construction machinery. Ah, uh, actually, my lupine bro, that was just me lecturing my workers with some... Uh, choice words. Sorry. Forgive me. 
It seems my lip reading is as abysmal as my construction industry knowledge. I have embarrassed myself once more. Ah, but all that stuff at the start was correct! Midsummer Incorporated's defensive weapons do use obsolete AI, as verified for us by our techie, the Grace. Hmm. It's a mystery, all right. But I think I've got it all figured out. The source of the ether activity must be Midsummer Incorporated's defense weapons. As rumors grew about the mysterious treasure, just think of all the rookies who must have come stumbling into Hollow C41, clumsily wandering through the warehouse and triggering all those defensive weapons. As more and more AI defense weapons were activated, ether corruption soared, and it became a breeding ground for etheric matter. Hmm, that would make sense. Looks like Nicole's internet and her brain are fully online now. So, we just need to stop the defensive weapons from being activated? Then what if we change the plan to address the root cause? Hmm. Based on the way these defensive weapons are distributed, it looks like the bigger ones are in the deeper areas of the warehouse. Then we need to stop these rookie hollow raiders from traipsing all over the place. That won't be easy. I understand the situation. We at Victoria Housekeeping will join with you in searching for these defensive weapons. Then let's put all the related info up on Internet, so anyone going exploring inside C41 will know what they're getting into. Okay, it's decided then. And so I hereby conclude this mission briefing. Right, Wise? Everyone knows what they need to do. Let's move out. <laughs> 